Hello, I'm going to show how to retarget an animation blueprint to another character. Select third person, next. Select blueprint, maximum quantity. Ray tracing disabled, desktop console, no starter content. I'm going to name my project retarget anim BP and press create. I'm using Unreal Engine version 4.24.3. Add Infinity Blade Wars to your project. Go to Content, Mannequin, Animations, right click, third person, Anim BP, retarget Anim Blueprints, duplicate Anim Blueprints and retarget. So you can see the target doesn't show up. So what we need to do is make sure both of the skeletons are set to humanoid rig. And I'll show you how to do that. Under Content, Mannequin, Character, Mesh. Double click UE4 Mannequin Skeleton. Go to Retarget Manager. We're going to set the skeleton to Humanoid Rig. Under Select Rig from the drop down, select Humanoid Rig and Save. Under Content, Infinity Blade Warriors. Character, Complete Characters, Double Click, SK, Mannequin Skeleton. Under Select Rig, from the drop down, select Humanoid Rig, and Save. Under Content, Mannequin, Animations, right click, Third Person, and MVP. Retarget and blueprints, duplicate and blueprints and retarget. Select the skeleton. Notice that what it says up here that the source and the target skeletons have to have the same pose. These already have the same pose, so it's okay. Press retarget. It puts the result in the content folder. I'm going to test the default mannequin character. Make can jump. Under content, third person BP, blueprints, Double click third person character. Go to viewport. Select the character. Change the skeletal mesh. I'm going to select this one. And change the anim class. There's two third person and MVP, so you have to select the correct one. I think this is the correct one. Compile and save and close that. I'm going to press play to test this character. jump. So that's working correctly. This asset came with more than one character so you can change to other characters. To do that double click the third person character. Go to viewport. Highlight the character. Change the skeletal mesh. I'm going to try this character and compile and save.
Now I'm going to test this character. I'll press play. And it can jump. So this character is working correctly. I'm going to show how to change the pose. Right click third person and a BP. Retarget and a blueprints. Select the target. If the source and the target pose don't match, I'll show you how to change the target pose. Go to the target skeleton. Double click the skeleton. On the skeleton tree tab, select upper arm left. Change the pose. Then select upper arm right and then change the pose now go to retarget manager modify pose use current pose save this close go back to the animation right click retarget and a blueprint Select the target. Now you see the pose is different. You want them to match, but I'm just showing you how to change it.